Hello everyone, this is my video, not for this document, it's my video for this document, the 3D design competition. Um, I've just written this um, competition document to explain um, this, Autodesk Tinkercad. Now this is very easy software to, to learn and I produced not that, I produced not that either, I produced this image, no, nope. <laughs> try again. Where's my design gone? Oh, I know. My apologies. It's here. I produced this design of a spanner following the tutorial on YouTube in about 15, 20 minutes. This software is really easy to use. And I made this myself uh, just following the tutorial. Um, this is for 3D printing. So you could actually uh, 3D print that out if you had such a printer. But since we don't, um, we can just try to win this competition. So how to win? Well, what to win? There's a big $500 gift card as a prize for this. Now, I don't precisely know what you can spend that card on, um, but it sounds attractive enough for us to be interested in it. Um, I put some ideas here. Well, this is their rules about how to win. And these are my suggestions about things that you could try. This is the Venus Project. Um, I have some contact with those people because I invited them to a conference in China a very long time ago. It's all about future engineering. And very few people know about that. And it might be possible to recreate some of their designs uh, in order to win the prize this way. There are five different ways to win the prize. Okay, um, put on some more advice here. And there's two links to the frequently asked questions and also to the rules. This is what you need. You've got to go Tinkercad and make um, an account with them. Then you've got to follow the tutorial, which is there. Follow the tutorial, which is there. And then copy and paste the screenshot from your design which should be the same as my design. And I'm, I have every confidence that you could do that in 15 minutes because I could. It's really easy to use. Um, this is what we will do in technology class next time. It is possible to design together. Um, I'll show you how. If you go to um, these things at the top here, invite people to design with you, I think you can actually team up on this and make your designs uh, together. Don't think that's necessarily a good idea when you're trying to win the competition and you want to keep your ideas to yourself just in case you have a winning idea. Uh, but when you're learning how to use it, maybe, maybe. If your internet connection is strong enough, maybe you could do that. But you don't have to. Um, I recommend giving that a go because now 3D printers are a lot cheaper. Um, there's going to be a lot of jobs in that kind of business. And if you can get a little bit good at it during the quarantine, um, that's all the better. Anyway, people, that's my video for the competition. But the actual tutorial which I want you to follow is that link there. And then put your screenshot in there. And then over the next three weeks, because we only have until the 1st of June, 1st of June to submit our competition entries, then you can work on your own ideas. And I will provide technical support. If there's something you want to know how to do, I will try to find out and I'll try to help you. Anyway, people, and that's the end of my video. Please read the documents and see if you want to participate in this. Um, I hope at least some of you do. Uh, goodbye.